I was referred to you from an internet forum member. The owner of a 16-year-old female Pomeranian consulted me in May 2009. The member said you perform tooth extractions in old dogs without using anesthetics. My Pomeranian has heart disease and will die of heart attack if her rotten teeth are extracted under anesthesia. I have not done any dental work without anesthesia, I replied. Tooth extraction is painful. It's just not possible to expect a dog to let any vet do extraction without biting the vet or running away. Singapore is a city-state with a population of around 4 million people in 2020. It is a popular tourist destination. Malayan and Chinatown are some of the major attractions. Durians are popular fruits, but some expectorate and a few locals cannot stand the pungent smell of durians. Back to Topayo Vet's consultation in May 2009. Small breeds of dogs are the most common as around 90% of the residents live in apartments. Pomeranians were the favourite gifts since 20 years ago. They are well cared for and live as long as 17 years in this case study. Miss Tan, the Pomeranian owner, knew her dog would not live past one month as the dog simply would not eat. My Pomeranian has difficulty breathing. The heart medication reduced her frequency of coughing but her paws are stained with her saliva drooling from her mouth daily. She will die soon as she has stopped eating. Please help her to live longer. Any dental extraction might cause her to die from fright as her heart could not take the stress and pain too, I explained. The owner understood the high risk involved. She consented to the dental work on condition that no sedation and anesthesia be used. This was the first time in over 30 years of practice at Topayo Vets to encounter such a request. Her dog was all bones under the thick coat. Emaciated, malnourished, death was at the doorstep. I took the chance to help this dog. This is my Be Kind to Pets veterinary story. Extraction of the bad, dead and loose teeth would get rid of the bacteria in her gums and mouth. She could eat and live longer too. This is a Be Kind to Pets veterinary story. Dr. Sing Kong Yuan, no anesthesia to extract 23 teeth in a very old dog. 16 months after dental work, the owner contacted me. Her dog was active, eating, drinking, and had no drooling. She had passed away around November 2010. The owner emailed me the following two images of a much younger looking old dog. The lady owner in her mid-30s had done her internet research well. She was very happy that her dog had lived for around 16 months. The internet connected us as many vets would not want to tarnish their professional reputation should the dog die during surgery. Here are some tips and advices for very old dogs undergoing anesthesia. The following practices are used by me. Number 1. IV drip Dextrosaline or 5% glucose for 5 minutes followed by a hot man's solution pre- and post-surgery. Batrio and tofadin are given via the drip, which has added multivitamins. Number 2. IV furosemide for dogs with heart disease before the operation. I gave the furosemide during the operation when I noticed that the old dog began to cough. Her heart disease medicine was not 100% effective. The IV furosemide stopped her coughing episodes. I extracted the 23 loose teeth slowly. There was no more teeth left as the other 19 teeth had dropped out over the years. A normal dog has 42 teeth. 3. IV painkiller like tofadin post-op 
if the dog has no kidney or liver disorders. The vet ought to do a blood test. For gaseous isoflurane and oxygen anesthesia without injectable sedatives is my anesthetic of choice. It is much safer for all canines as they recover fast. Endotracheal tube intubation is needed. What is the endotracheal tube? An endotracheal tube is a flexible plastic tube that is placed through the mouth into the trachea to help a patient breathe. The endotracheal tube is then connected to an anesthetic machine which delivers anesthetic gas and oxygen to the lungs. For more videos, please visit our website or call in to our clinic.